spend the money in the round Get your shit around, fucking be around Hey y'all, welcome back to the channel. I'm Amber and today I'm gonna to be showing you guys how I refresh and wash my braids. These braids are giving three weeks in summer camp and I just got back home. <laughs> so I'm gonna show you guys how I refresh them and get them decent enough to keep them in one more week. So if you wanna see how to refresh your braids, then just keep watching. You make me wanna go. So after the shampooing of the braids, I'm just going to take some of this melanin oil and I'm just going to oil my scalp everywhere. This is going to give us some hydration and it's also going to give us a little bit of shine. Got me feeling like a ball hole. So next I'm just going to take some edge control. I am using the Style Factor Edge Booster and the scent Lemon Candy Sweets. That's a bit detailed, but that's what I'm using. And then I'm just going to take an edge brush and I'm going to do my edges and kind of reshape and form my edges back into my braids if that makes sense so i'm just gonna do that because i have a lot of edges out now that are no longer in the braid and this whole braid right here this whole braid right here is like lifted i don't know what happened but i just have a ton of edges out so i'm gonna make them appear to be back in and yeah Okay, so I did my edges, as you can see, just my edges. Now you're going to take your mousse. I'm taking this Nairobi foam wrap. So we're gonna apply a ton, and you're going to direct your edges along with this. 
Also, I'm using this foam because it has a shine to it and we need shine. I'm applying the foam, but I'm sorting the hair kind of, directing the hair where I need it to go so the foam will lay it. I love you too, poo poo. So I'm getting the hair going all in one direction so it can be flat. And I'm even taking it to the back. Just some more on this side. So you see how this is really the hair sticking out? When you apply the foam, it's gonna lay it. So make sure you apply the foam and then direct the hair where you want it to lay. I'm about to hit you with the work, boy. I hate coming through stunning on niggas that I know. Uh, that's the worst, boy. It's not hot that you be calling me, stressing me, paging my beat, but you just not stop. And it's not hot that you be leaving me messages every single day. So now I'm going to put my scarf on and I'm going to make sure I got my edges in there and you don't have to wait for the foam to dry or anything like that. Just put your scarf on and then make sure your scarf where you're going to tie it is where your edges are. I tie mine really tight, like headache tight, especially because I'm not going to have it on here for a while. So, you know, I could tie it real tight for a minute. Okay, so you should see your foam coming through. I'm now going to take a hair tie and I'm going to tie the scarf. I'm going to tie that and then I'm going to wait like really however long. You can go to sleep in this, whatever, but I'm just going to do it for about... Mm. I'm gonna do it like 30 minutes and then I'm gonna take it off just until I leave the house and I'll be back to show y'all the finished look okay I'm back so I'm just gonna take this crunchy off now I'm just going to take it looks so much better okay like we're still giving you need to take your braids out but it's not giving three weeks of summer camp okay this will definitely get you by another week but if your braids are kind of still looking fresh and you do this they're gonna look popping yeah, this is the finished look i hope this video was helpful this isn't a video to like keep your braids in another month this is just gonna hold you for a couple more days until you're able to take your hair out so yeah that is it for this video if you enjoyed it please let me know by giving me a thumbs up hit the bell so you never miss an upload and i will see you in the next video bye